Hello everyone and welcome back to another Neopets Dailies with Toast. Um, today I kind of wanted to start off and kind of just cover the notable things that happened last week um, that since my last video. Um, one of the big things here um, is that I actually ended up getting a second rainbow fountain dip um, through the Gray Fairy. So last time um, I had dipped Soft Fill and I was hoping to get another one so that we could dip um, Janelle, my Galert, and so that's what we did. <laughs> um, so I did end up pre-recording me dipping her because I got another um, Gray Fairy quest, and since the Gray Fairy can give you rainbow fountain dips, I didn't want to accidentally um, override my last fountain dip, because you can only have one stacked up. Like, you don't have to use it immediately, but you cannot have two, essentially. So if you get another fountain dip, then your last one is just voided. You, nothing happens. So I did go ahead and pre-dip uh, Janelle. So here we go. So I'm super excited um, to be dipping uh, Janelle because here we have her as our beautiful little green galert. I had previously entered her into <clears throat> the um, dream pet giveaway, and so I wanted to dip her previously, but I decided to hold her on the back burner and dip my uh, plushy rake, and so today we are going to be dipping Janelle Moroccan, so I am super excited to be doing that. And here we go. Oh my gosh. Wow, Janelle looks really good now. Oh, look at her. Oh, what a cutie pie. Oh my gosh. So that's so exciting. Let's go ahead and take a look at her. Janelle. Oh my gosh. What a stinking cutie. I can't believe we finally have a Moroccan Galert. This is our second eel on the account. Um, you know, besides ELT, of course, being the first eel. Um, I just, I love the colors of the Moroccan Galert. I've always been a fan. I definitely want to get her a nostalgic Galert token, but honestly, I love her the way that she looks even converted. Um, and then Grandpa, the elderly Gathal. Now, this is a zapped pet pet. Um, I forgot what it was originally. Um, originally, it was the Floud. So, I like her with this pet pet. I think it looks like a drenched cat. Like, um, which is perfect, in my opinion, for a Moroccan pet. I just, I don't know. I like the colors. I, I called him Grandpa because he's just, like, cute and old. Um, now, I noticed that they were recently giving out elderly Gathows as a prize that you can win um, on the Neopies, which is also something else that has started since my last video. Um, so I'm going to talk about that soon. But before we do that, I actually want to... Um, customize Janelle. So let me check out what our daily dailies are because I want to get credit if uh, we're supposed to customize a pet for the day. So yeah, customize a pet is one of them. So I'm going to go ahead and go back and we're going to customize Janelle right now. Because I don't think that I have too much um, when it comes to, like, stuff that I can have a Moroccan wear at the moment. Um, but we definitely want to spice her up a little bit. So let's go ahead and do that. 
first. Oh, she's so cute. Okay. So I had her wearing some some glasses in her previous look. I think I might actually keep her with those. Um let's see what else can I get her? No. I don't know if any of these other items are aren't loading in. Let's see. I love this tree because it's got the little cherry blossoms, and I think that that's just you know such a vibe for her. Um, I don't think I can also have these in conjunction. I want to give her something aquatic. Uh, at least as far as a background goes. I know obviously this is the opposite of aquatic. Um, but yeah, because I mean, obviously she's uh, she's an eel, so I want to give her something. Um, it's, too, it's clashes too much. I had her here in this river at one point. Like she's over here chilling by the river. But I want to I want to put her in the river. You know. Um, I really don't have a lot of aquatic anything. I, I should have prepared for this. <laughs> I really should have prepared better and gotten her something nicer. You know, I could have gotten some uh more backgrounds. Uh, maybe I have her chilling at the beach. No, I I like the colors of the background, but I just feel like it clashes too much. Um, I'm curious what the heck these are because they're obviously broken. <laughs> they're obviously broken. I don't know what the heck that is about. I wonder... Um, okay, I think that this could suffice for now. I know, I think I like this one a little more. Yeah, I feel like this is okay for now. I definitely want to update it later. Um, but this is okay. Okay, so. Um. Yeah. Because, like, I love Yilti's background. I know I've said this in the past, but, like, Yilti's background is so, like, vibes. Um, I like that he's, like, in the water. So I want to do something similar for Janelle at some point. But I'll take care of that later, and then we can update that together. So um, before I start talking about the Neo Bees... Um, I want to also update the rest of my pets. So, Vulgar, um, it's the same. I haven't, come on, I haven't done anything special with him or his customization, but I gave him a Darrigan Slorg, which I think fits him so well. Um, I think that they look really good together. Let me see if. I can pull them up. Look at that. Look at that. His name is Duke. So his little dookie. <laughs> uh, yeah. I I love it. I feel like this matches so well. They are perfect. Um, at some point, I will paint him there again. Because right now he's pirate. But I will do that later. Later. Um, Other updates. I brought Kadori over. Um, from my, what is turning into my baby side. Um, I gave her a snow kadoti that I called Dodie. That I want to eventually paint something. I just haven't figured out which color kadoti I want. But it, as long as they're connected, that makes me happy. So, um, I did have a baby Aisha on my account a couple months ago. But I did trade her out because I just decided that I wanted this name and I finally got around to painting her and she's just been chilling on my side. Um, I did 
trade out Ben Jenny, who was our previous lab rat. So our current lab rat is Generis, um, who might stay because I like the name. Um, I created him. I didn't pick him up at the pound or anything. Um, this was just one of the names that was available that was on my list. Um, actually, at the time when I was trying to think of a name for Janiel, Generis was one of the names that I was actually thinking for Janiel. Um, but I like Janiel because I plan on making her an eel. So her name is Jen and she's an eel. So it's Janiel. Um, Generous is right now just a cute blue bory. So yeah. Um, I traded out um, Tinkerbell for this really cute um, fairy drake is wearing the exact same thing that Tinkerbell was wearing. Um, but I, I don't know. I got this offer. It's got a pet lookup, an old pet lookup, and an ancient freaking abominable snowball. So I think that's pretty great. Um, yeah. So, I mean, I don't know how I feel about it being a snowball. I'm probably going to change the name. Um, I don't even know if it's zapped or not let's find out let's see no it is an abominable snowball so i mean i thought about zapping it but i don't i don't want to like accidentally destroy it it's freaking ancient um 6520 days that's literally only a few days younger than grenades um so, in other things that happened this past week, I actually ended up knocking over another coconut. And I don't know why this is always happening off screen, but I ended up winning this golden evil coconut that I sold for a little under a mil, which was fantastic. So, yeah. Um, shocker. I've been playing this my whole life, basically, and I've now hit down two coconuts. So, I don't know if the odds are getting better or if it's, you know, just because the numbers game. <laughs> Uh, it's finally coming up, and because it's had so many no's, I finally got two yeses almost in a row, uh, at least on a weekly basis, so that's what's up. I will take it. Um, so yeah. So, um, let's see. Uh, I did want to talk about the Neopies, because that's another really big thing that's been going on. Um, I have not done today's Neopi voting. So the Neopies is like an awards show that you get to vote on like the best whatevers for the year, um, in different, uh, categories. So I'm going to scroll back to the previous announced winners here. Okay. So best NP wearable. Oh wait. Okay. Let's start up here. Best Advent Comet, because this was the first day that they did it. Um, the Best Advent Comet, Advent Comic. So you got to submit your vote on which day's comic out of the lineup here you thought was the best. I chose this one because I thought it was very emotional. Uh, this one definitely had better prizes, but I was not a big fan of the comic itself. This one I thought was really nice, the Wizard Appreciation. And then this one I also thought was pretty good. I had a feeling that this one might win, but overall I'm kind of glad that this one won. Because I thought it was the most sentimental out of all of them. Um, Best new NP item. Um, I voted for the Spellmade and Quiguki doll because I love me a Quiguki. Um, but apparently the Fjornome is the one that actually won, which is fine. Um, and then the best NP wearable, um, apparently these were all for during the fairy festival, which I was not participating in. Um, I was torn between the service pet doggo fox and the pink wings and I chose the pink wings because like, I don't know, I thought that these actually looked pretty nice and I could see myself using this more, but realistically, this is not a bad win either. So, 
the service pet dog fox one, which is not bad. And then, so these two are waiting for results. These are the last two votes that we had, and it was best Festival of Negs prize, another event that I was not here for, so I'm definitely looking forward to the Festival of Negs coming up soon. Um, I voted for the Polar Lights Foreground because it's something that I actually have equipped to one of my pets right now. I sought out, I sought it out after I saw it and I was like, oh, I like this. I want to have it. And I got it and I think it looks good. So that, um, Plasma Effect looks dope. Um, Stamp of Neopia, everybody likes a good stamp and a solar flare gun, which I think is a battle dome item so we'll see which one wins from those and then best advent prize this is the one that's coming soon uh to the voting or end i guess so best advent prize i went with the pebble because obvious choice obvious choice like christmas pet pets background like it's it's cute but it's super seasonal i like the rana stamp a lot i think that it has a very interesting I don't know image trapped in paper also very like specific so pebble in my opinion absolute best so they've been giving out prizes um for voting so these are everything that um you can get just for voting. It kind of works similar to the advent calendar where Reina pops up and you click on it and you get like a random prize kind of deal. So it's not the same every day for everyone. Um, I so far have gotten day one. I got a Colt Zam book. Um, I got this Borovan asparagus mug. I got, um, I think I got the ruler. Maybe. And what was it? Three or four items? One, two, three items. Okay, so yeah, I got uh I got Colt Zam book, which was worth like twenty seven thousand when I looked it up that day. Um Boravan Asparagus mug, which I'm not sure i think it's like 2np and then um i think i won the pf ruler i think that was the one of the last items that i got the other day it was it was some sort of stationery and this is the only stationery that i'm seeing like we got that pocket was an organizer but i don't think that was it either so yeah i think oh no maybe it was the rainbow pride flag no it was the tweezers it was the tweezers it was one of something like that. I think I have a rainbow pride flag. Maybe I just like the PFN ruler because it's cute. But yeah, so some people have been getting really dope stuff like a marble drake egg, which hatches into a marble drake. Like, um, excuse me, drake enthusiast over here, please. Some people have been getting Valentine paintbrushes. Like, um, what? They've got magical msp poogle plushies which turn your pet into an msp poogle like um hello uh i want that um yeah i also really want the elderly gath thou which is, i don't know how much that's going for right now considering that it's a neopi prize oh sixty seven thousand. so i could go out and get this and give that to janelle so that she has a real elderly gath out because I'm not going to be zapping her no more. Uh, just because I like it and give her real grandpa. Um, yeah. So, I am definitely hoping for, you know, a couple of items. Everything here, so from what I understand, everything here came out last year. So, Everything is a new item because it's from 2023. Look at that Halloween Hassie. That's that's cute as heck. Oh, he's only 36,000. I might go buy one. Um, Gamer Quiguki, also super cute. 2,000 NP. I'll, I'll go buy that. Um, 
I like the gray Rue Island background. I love stuff like this. Not only 9,000. I might buy that too. Lost Souls background. Also very cute. With all the ghost pets. I might go buy that too. So, yeah. Some nice stuff. Some nice stuff. Uh, why is this not a wearable? This should be a wearable. It's an instrument. The instruments should be wearable. I'm just saying. Uh... Yeah. Six Nights at Sloth's background. Oh my gosh. Oh jeez. Okay. So, yeah. There's some decent things out there. Look at that orange rock. I love that. Uh, so let's see what we're going to get today. And what are we going to vote on? So, best Altador Cup prize. I was also not participant of the Altador Cup. Um, but if I had to choose, I, I kind of, okay, like retro Altador Cup field background. I'm not really into like the 8 bit stuff. I, I'm, okay, I like the potential the 8 bit could have been as somebody who is a big fan and, you know, player of the original, uh, Pokemon games, like, I've seen some 8-bit fan art that looked really solid and, in my opinion, better than the official 8-bit works. Um, no offense, no shade to the TNT team, um, but I, I th think it could have been executed better. Um, Tandrak, Shay, Bobblehead, I mean, who doesn't like a Dairy Galert? Like, for real, though. Like, I don't know who this is, but apparently Bad Boy Heartthrob of the Derrigan Citadel Althador Cup team is here for a bobblehead form. Who could resist this prize? I mean, honestly, I might choose that. Um, Golden Althador Cup coin. Like, who doesn't like a nice coin? This prize for remembering your time at the Althador Arena while also being a great addition to your coin collection. Okay. Um, and then Teko Fanatic stamp. The perfect stamp for all those passionate fans who want to send contesting letters to the Altador Cup committee or fan letters to their favorite Altador Cup athletes. Um, I I like Teko Fanatic, like especially his bobblehead. It's pretty hilarious. Um, but I feel bad even voting because I wasn't here for any of this stuff, but I think I'm going to go with Tandrax Shay just because, like, I, I like a good bobblehead. Um, if his bobblehead came out this year, I would have chose this one because that was also a great item. So I'm going to go ahead and submit my vote, and we get a Fiora Gnome. All right. Um, so, yeah, that was the, that was the Neopi. So that's going to be going on until, I think, like, the beginning of next uh, month, like the third or something like that. Uh, yeah, I think it's like 28 days total or something, and we skipped day two or something. No tickets. How come I don't have any tickets? VIP raffle. I don't know what this is about. Let's see. How do you get tickets? Oh, NC Mall. Um... Oh, some new. Oh, that's cute. Uh, bittersweet chocolatier, sweetheart Graham. Let's see what else is out. I know I should be doing dailies, but ooh, a vignette. Oh, ooh, that pastel bun is really cute. Oh my gosh, who could we try that on? Um. Uh, I would say Catery, because, I don't know, I could see her wearing that, but I, I don't think I could put that on, uh, I don't think I could put that on a mutant. Um, okay, how about Diddy, who apparently is colored like a fairy right now, even though she's not actually a fairy. Ixie? Okay. Let's try that on. 
is incompatible with this new opus color. It's because I have her wearing a NC fairy thingamajig. Um, okay, fine. Oh my god, this pink Valentine velour tracksuit. Oh my god, I kind of want to get that for vulgar. Okay, let's get out of the NC mall before this causes problems. <laughs> let's go. Mutant spring headband. Oh, I could probably put that on. Let's go. Get Take me out of here. Guys. Let's do our dailies. And really heart makeup. See, I need to stop looking. Golden heart confetti. Okay. All right. Let's 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 leave. Oh, look. Quest log. Ha, ha, ha. All right. Purchase an item from any Neopian shop. Spin the Wheel of Knowledge of Bright Veil. Play a game and groom a pet. Okay. Okay. So let's go ahead and purchase an item. Let's go to the... <laughs> Where are you? Healing Springs. There we go. We'll grab one of those. Heal while we're here. Nice. Nice. And we need to buy two items. So let's go ahead and check out uh, Ugga Shinies, which is where I've been frequenting recently, trying to find some cute stuff. I really need, desperately need more wearables, but I don't like any of this. Um, how about unis? I thought it said grotesque. Gorgonesque? Gorgonesque, okay. Um... No, I don't want any of this. Let's check out the toy shop. Um, we'll go ahead and get this wind up Nirana. <clears throat> and cool. I think that's all we needed. I can't help but look. Okay. So we got those. And then spin the wheel of knowledge in Bright Vale. I'm gonna go up here and check out the dailies. And then go down here. And we'll get some wheels. Spin that wheel of knowledge and see what kind of wisdom it imparts on us today. A dung shield. Okay. That's great. Um, let's also spin the wheel of mediocrity while we're here. And broke even. Spin the wheel of excitement. Let's see how exciting today's prize is. Oh, 208 ear points. So exciting. So exciting. Okay. So we spun our wheels. And play a game. Okay, let's go ahead. And play something. Destructo matches the 2x and Wingo Ball. Okay. Um, can I, can I just like gripe for a moment? So on the first, it always resets, um, the top scores and I was number one for a while. Okay. I was number one for like two solid days and then I dropped down to like number six or number five, somewhere in the middle of silver. Now I'm over here in nine. I should have gotten a gold trophy on the second but let let's let's look at my lookup huh let's look at my lookup and see which trophy i got oh look i got the second place trophy you mean they actually gave me a freaking trophy finally 
I seriously did not have a trophy for Igloo Garage Sale for a long time. And it looks like they finally awarded me something, even though this is less than the one I should have gotten to begin with. Whatever. It's fine. At least I got another trophy. All right. Today, let's just play Fashion Fever. I swear, that was the second month in a row that it had broken for me. Um, because I should have gotten bronze last month, January 1st, 2nd. So. At least I got a silver. One more trophy to my trophy cabinet that I didn't have before. Let's go ahead and send that. Oh, and look, we got 600 NP. That's great. Okay. And last but not least, we gotta go groom a pet. So let's go check out our inventory. Um, I don't have anything in here, so let me grab my comb. And there we go. So let's go ahead and comb soft fill today. Softfield says, wow, cool. Okay. And that should be the last of that. So let's claim all of our daily dailies so that we can get our 20K for the day. All right. Nice. And the weekly is a self paintbrush because I am a bitch and couldn't reset on a freaking stealth paintbrush, even though I already have one. And I couldn't hold out. And I was like, I could keep resetting and try to get my fairy cadote or another croc, but I'm just going to get the stealthy paintbrush because I'm a bitch and I can't, I can't, I can't reject it. I couldn't reject it. Okay. Let's go ahead and do our other regular dailies. So starting with anchor management. And we got a two Dublin coin. Okay. Go ahead and bob for apples. I swear I'm gonna punch this no this Norbu in the face. Uh got some pumpkin cookies. Okay, he didn't give us a disease today, thank God. Collected our interest. Go check out Colt Zan. What's the daily puzzle today first, though? In which Neopian land can you find Neovia? I want to say Haunted Woods. But I don't know what... I don't know. I've never been to Neovia. Nothing happened at Cold Sands. All right. Um, daily puzzle. Haunted Woods. Okay. That's what I thought. Like, who is Neovia? Like, what? Where? Um, Forgotten Shore, which we've been forgotten about all week. Oh, look, we finally got some NP today. Yay, 10,000. Okay. It's not bad. But I want a freaking Drake Morphing Potion or Croc Morphing Potion. Come on now. I know, I'm greedy. So greedy. I've been playing Neopets for forever. And I'm still not happy. Hey, I got a chia fruit. Yay. With the amount of bullshit that we get from these games, we really should be allowed to play on multiple accounts. Um, Just saying. Because, like, at the, at the rate that the botters get away with, and we can't even, you know, spin the fruit machine more than once a day is it's real bullshit okay but i'm not gonna get started on all that crap because it's uh it's a lot of crap it really is all right let's see what the expella box gets us today some sand cherries oh disgusting all right cool let's get this going on um let's see we've got 
three purples. Oops. So that one, that one, and that one, which means that this has to be that, which means this has to be the shield, which means that, let's see, we got two reds down here. We got the flower and the shield, and the last one up is going to be a yellow shield. So let's go ahead and submit that. And we got Shanku City stamp. Okay. All right. Did we say hi to the Rich Lord? I can't remember. We have not. All right. 50 cents from the Rich Lord. Thank you, Rich Lord. Let's check out the other the plushie of prosperity. Nothing happened. Play some tombola. Nothing. Impress the wise old king. Nothing. And okay. Lost desert. Been doing the lost desert ones ever since I got the uh, avatar for S -S -S Sydney at the uh, the uh, what is it the carnival in the haunted woods? What is it called? I don't know. My brain's not working. Let's throw that away. Okay. Play. See if we get anything today. Nope, nothing. Um, fairy caverns, lever of doom, and nothing in the fairy caverns, lever of doom. Come on, lever. All right, we'll go check that later. Go get some coconut shy, test your strength, and check my portfolio. Okay. Let's see if we can catch me blowing one up on camera today. Oh my gosh, everything is lagging. Okay, we got uh, minus 100 Neo points from the lever. Oh my gosh. Oh, we got pathetic today. Okay, more than useless. And let's see, anything here worth selling? No, anything worth buying? Was that 15? That was that 15? That was that 15? I'll just get one of these then. Okay, perfect. Play some more coconut since it glitched out or whatever. And miss. And miss. Oh, jiggle into coconuts. Oh my gosh, I can't deal with lag. Okay, jiggle into coconuts. I'm like Neopets, if I just wanted a lag simulator, I would downgrade my PC. <laughs> Okay, no more throws today. Um, all right, we did all those. Check out the lab ray. And then so we gotta do a fairy quest. Maybe I'll do the fairy quest first, okay, because yeah, my cookie ends in eleven hours. So I have today's cookie. And then I think, yeah, I'll have enough time when it resets to have do it again to quote tomorrow because I'm, I'm doing this video kind of late compared to when I usually do them. I usually try to get it right at reset, but I really lagged last night and did not. So we got Water Fairy today. Made my heart stop for a moment thinking it was our favorite, our favorite fairy, the Fountain Fairy, but it wasn't. 
Okay, let's go here to pesos. Pesos, 79. Buy this Grundo Ballet book from him. Okay. And then we'll go ahead and reopen it from here. And give her the book. ELT's defense has increased. Thank you. Okay. Oh, wait, you know what? I got to open another cookie for that. So let's go ahead and zap Wujit first. And once again, nothing happens. This is like the fourth day in a row. Um, I'm going to go get my cookie. All right, get our cookie. Open that up today. See if we have as much luck as last week. Okay, two. Not as much, but you know what? Two is better than one. So go ahead. Let's refresh. Actually, I'll just open it again. So two extra zaps a day. This will be first zap, and then we'll get two more after because it's extras. So we are zapping Generis. And they gain two movement points. Okay. And then we're going to go ahead and zap Generis again. Hoping they give us something cool. You know, sometimes my arrows freeze up. Like, they're not responding. Let me open it up again. Neopets is a working website, isn't it? It really works. Okay. But I like being a Bori. And she goes down to level one. Oh my god. Can we get something that's not a stat boost or decrease, really? Can we get something else? Our final zap for the day. And for max HP. All right, great. That's totally what we wanted. <laughs> All right. Now, last but not least, is Battle Dome. So, we are taking on Jetsam Ace at medium with our best boy, ELT, as per usual. So, let's get it, ELT. Let's get those Nurk mids. My boy. They really got to update the prize pools for the whole website. I swear to God. I, I can only take so many grown to the wise. Okay. For Ronda Wise, how many are these we're going to get? I swear I already have like 99 in my safety deposit box. Can only take so many. Space cereal. I don't think they can eat cereal in space with all the, the milk. You can't you can't have the milk like that. I'm shaking my damn head. Honestly, I can't wait for the Neg Festival because I have not participated in a Neg Festival at all. So this is going to be really exciting for me. And then I'm hoping for some plot development. Like, I'm hoping for, you know, plot to come in and take the mic from the Neopies guy. And be like, hey, this shit's going down. 
You know, I think uh, they put out a roadmap for what is supposed to happen for the rest of this uh, month, year, quarter. I don't know. And so the plot itself is happening sometime after Festival of Negs. So take that as you will. Um, which I think Festival of Negs is after Neopis. I think we're coming up on Festival of Negs hopefully sooner rather than later. Oh, some codestones. Always use some cold stones. I don't show it ever, but I I train ELT still at the uh, Mystery Island Trading or er, Training Academy, not Trading Academy. Another cold stone. I'll take it. Oh my gosh. Some days I feel like Battle Dome never ends. Oh, Flutter. I think I only have like 56 of those. I mean, it's like, yeah, okay, we want, we want Code Stones and we want Nerf Mids from Jetsam Ace. And, like, we understand it can't always be the good stuff, but, like, give us other random shit. Like, maybe Jetsam Ace has a, you know, small percentage of dropping a Moroccan Pet Pet paintbrush. Or maybe Jetsam Ace might have a small percentage of dropping a Jetsam Morphing Potion. Or, you know, a one in a thousand, ten thousand chance to drop a Moroccan paintbrush. You know, like, give us something. Or a Moroccan pet pet. Like, come on. Do better, Neopets. <laughs> Do better. We want to play the game and get rewarded for it, right? Like, I know it's gotten better, but it could, it could get better, right? Like... Am I asking too much? Yeah, I probably am. So, yeah. Um, I am over the moon that we got two fountain fairy dips, like, just within a week of each other. Like, that's just amazing to me. We got soft fill. I think I did that in the last video. And then we got our beautiful Janiel in this video so thank you so much for coming and hanging out with me i am over the moon that we're at like over 50 subscribers i genuinely was like in disbelief like i never thought um that i would see that especially so soon um it feels like i've only been doing this for a short while i Truly appreciate you hanging out and spending time with me. And I hope to see you again very soon. Um, should hopefully be putting something out uh, other than these dailies videos. Um, and maybe something new coming out uh, in the near future that's not even Neopets related. So um, stick around. Thank you so much. I know I said that like a hundred times today, but you have a wonderful day. Bye.